What is up YouTube, Edge Plains here, and uh, today I uh, want to talk about uh, Xander Ford and also share my two cents, uh, my opinion uh, regarding this hot topic. Right off the bat, when I was watching Rated K, um, the very first thing I took away from the story of Malo Arizal I was that he never really learned to uh, embrace and love the skin that he was in and uh, it was evident um, in his strong desire to uh, undergo uh, surgery and the fact that he even went as far as figuratively killing uh, his old persona to make way to the new one uh, which is uh, Xander Ford now I'm not saying that um, <clears throat> I'm not saying that uh, surgical enhancement is wrong. Um, I'm, I'm all for it. Uh, I strongly think that if uh, if it's something that will uh, uh, dramatically uh, improve your quality of life, then um, by all means I think you should uh, go for it. But um, I think that there should also be an even bigger focus on body positivity and uh, self-love. I think um, beyond the uh, physical appearance that there's still a lot of work to be done. Um, <clears throat> I strongly feel that he still has so much to uh, work on um, internally and mentally um, to make sure that everything is aligned uh, for him to actually be able to uh, keep up to this new image and even uh, live up to it. I just hope that he's also getting the uh, proper mental health support that he uh, obviously needs at this uh, uh, overwhelming uh, time in his life and career. I really do hope that he uh, makes something out of this, hey, to actually uh, make use of the buzz and the noise that he's making and build something from it and be more than just a, uh, a trending topic or a meme of 2017. Marlo has figuratively killed himself to uh, make way to his brand new persona, Xander Ford. And uh, Marlo admitted that um, bullying was actually one of the main factors um, he's decided to undergo the surgery. Um, the dark reality is that bullying related suicide takes about 4,400 lives a year. And Xander, Marlo, or anyone for that matter, could actually become part of that statistic. I know it's a lot easier said than done, but people should actually just really focus on um, building a much tougher exterior and learn to just not give a damn and just do your own thing and just own it. I mean, a quick look on your newsfeed or Twitter would uh, show you that um, Xander uh, didn't really escape his online bashers. And I mean, it just goes to show that um, there really is no pleasing everyone. So you just basically, you should just basically do whatever it is the hell you want and, you know, just own it. Just before I end this vlog, I uh, want to wish uh, Xander Ford, if you're watching, um, all the best. And I truly do hope that you make something out of this new opportunity, this new life that's been given to you and build something from it and I uh, truly do hope that you also use the platform uh, that you have uh, to inspire and uh, motivate uh, your peers and um, yeah I uh, wish you all the best and stay strong and kapit lang. Peace.